Do you have anything like this in your house, under your house, in your attic? Open wire splices are one of the most unsafe conditions you can have. The National Electrical Code says all wire splices have to be safely contained in some type of box. This could prevent fires. If you get under your house, in your attic, in your basement, in your crawl space, anywhere, and you see open wire splices, take care of it immediately. Now the traditional way of fixing this is turn off the power, undo all the wire splices, pull that apart, get a junction box, screw it to the structure, buy some wire fasteners, buy some staples, get a cover plate, Put it all back together. Who got time for that? That's a lot of work. I get it. Who wants to mess with that? There has to be an easier way, and I found it. Have you heard of open splice junction boxes? I found these on the internet, and these are going to be your new best friend. When you open it up, the mounting hardware is included. This clamshell design will safely take care of your problem. This time, we don't have to dismantle the wiring. Let me show you how quick and efficient it's going to be. You're going to take your new clamshell design open splice box. You're going to place it over the electrical hazard. There's these fold down clips here. So break them away. You're going to use between one and four. Now the kit comes with a couple different screws. The long screws are for mounting the box and the short screws are for closing the box. This will make sure you meet code. Now you do want to screw the box into something firm. In this case, we'll do it to our simulated subfloor. You could install a new two by four if you needed to mount it in this orientation, just depending on how much room you have to move the wire splice around. So in this case, we can mount it right down to the subfloor. Now with your junction box firmly installed, simply fold the electrical splice, this is the unsafe condition. A splice is the weak spot in all your circuits. If that was to short out, become loose, a fire could start. And believe it or not, you're 80% done. You're literally going to close up your safe junction box and with the provided screws, close it on down. Now, if your loose electrical wire is more than 12 inches from your box, make sure to nail in a new wire staple. Here on the other side of the joist, we're covered. We already have wire staples. You have taken care of that electrical problem. It was an unsafe condition, and you have made it safe for your family and your loved ones. Congratulations. You did it. This will last for years and years to come. I've included the product link down below in the video description. Now, as an Amazon associate, I do make a few pennies every time you buy these. So just keep that in mind, but thank you for supporting the channel. I'll see you next week.